I'm Nathan Phillips and I've been studying gas leaks in the Boston area for a few years now and we're looking at a soil burn related to a gas leak that's out here on Nonantum Road near the Watertown-Newton border. And so you can see that the soil is really very bare and desiccated, little patches of greenery until you get up to this area and it gets a whole lot greener. at a newly paved street and they're digging up the road again a lost opportunity because this was so recently paved and they've done a little pipeline replacement we saw some cast iron replaced with plastic there's still a 24 inch cast iron pipe running through here we looked at drill holes coming from the end of the street this way and didn't smell any gas coming out of them but after this steel plate we start to smell it here so kind of makes sense that they're kind of working this way and 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 you know triaging this leak uh in 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 this direction what's happened in the past is to address the explosion hazard they've taken a manhole cover like this which is fairly covered and replaced it with a slotted manhole cover so what that does is it brings the percent gas down below an explosion threshold, but at the same time it's doing that by venting more gas out in the atmosphere. So by addressing the safety issue against explosion, it exacerbates the loss issue and the climate impacts.